Uh, this year, U.S. News & World Report confirmed what we already know. Washington is the best state in the nation. As my second term as governor draws to a close, I wanted to share some of the incredible things your state government has achieved to help earn that title. Because of our efforts to grow our economy and improve wages, Washington is consistently ranked as the best place in the nation to do business. And when the pandemic hit, we mobilized quickly to get assistance to business and families that need it most. We were also named the best state to work, thanks in part to implementing the nation's best overtime protections, a strong paid sick leave law, protecting gender pay equity, and making Washington one of the safest states for workers. We reduced carbon pollution and toxics in our ecosystems. We protected the Puget Sound and the orcas and salmon that depend on it. And we restored habitat and found solutions to complex water issues made worse by climate change. We launched the nation's leading paid family and medical leave program and delivered more than $12.5 billion worth of unemployment benefits to more than a million Washingtonians during the COVID-19 crisis. We kept Washington moving by delivering on big projects like the SR99 connector. We greened our infrastructure through projects like our hybrid electric ferry program and energy efficient buildings. And we partnered with Washington's Native American tribes to open miles and miles of habitat for salmon and steelhead. We called upon the entire Washington National Guard for the first time since World War II to help keep communities safe, combat record-breaking wildfires, help secure our election system, and fight the COVID-19 pandemic on almost every front, working in food pantries, as contact tracers, and running test sites. At the same time, we have hundreds of men and women in the Washington National Guard serving overseas. We passed the nation's best 100% clean energy bill. We've launched Career Connect Washington to help prepare our young people for their careers in our communities. We launched the Washington College Grant, the nation's most generous financial aid program, providing more options to more Washington students than ever before. We celebrated and helped launch Washington State University's Cosmic Crisp Apple and protected Washington State from multiple invasive species, most recently eradicating the first Asian giant hornet's nest in the United States. We launched a state-of-the-art virtual reality training system to improve safety and give employees the skills to safely manage crisis de-escalation and build empathy for our patients. We launched the nation's first public option insurance program. We built a trades-related apprenticeship coaching program to better equip incarcerated individuals for success after their release. Connected close to 50,000 veterans with the benefits they earn by serving our country. We made historic investments in education, including the largest teacher pay raise in the country. And we continued to improve the nation's best voting system. We modernized state technology systems, helped transition most of state government online to protect state workers and the people of Washington from COVID-19. We created one unified agency where there were three and attracted new federal funds to prevent our youth from entering foster care. We raised the minimum age to purchase tobacco and vape products to 21, dramatically improved nutrition assistance program for women, children, and infants, and after being the first to confirm a COVID-19 diagnosis, we've been among the most successful states in the nation in keeping cases, hospitalization, and deaths low. We've accomplished a lot in these last four years. Now we set our sights on the next four. We will recover from the impacts of COVID-19. We will make big strides in defeating the climate crisis. We will build back the best economy in the country and we will continue to build a more just, equitable, and inclusive state. And we'll prove once again, Washington is the best state in the nation.